Hey guys, it's your man Blue Rapid, and today, not only is it my birthday, but this week Power Rangers came out, which I went to go see last night. For those of you who are wondering, today I turned 25, which can be kind of depressing, but hey, at least I can rent a car without paying extra fees, right? <laughs> So like I said, yesterday I went to go see Power Rangers, which was a really, really good movie. I was afraid it was going to be bad, but it was really good. I cannot wait to see more because they did say, I did see somewhere on Facebook that they are planning to make, or at least they have the material to make, five more movies, people. Five. I'm not going to spoil it for you guys, but the movie was great. There were so many Easter eggs in there. Oh my god! They mentioned Mariner Bay and Reefside, which, if, for those of you who don't know, Mariner Bay is where Lightspeed was, and Reefside was where Dino Thunder was, which, beauty, I love Dino Thunder, because Dr. Tommy Oliver was in it. Now, I'm not going to spoil everything for you and tell you pretty much the whole story, but they did a lot of good things that I approved of, and if it wasn't for the fact that the Mighty Morphin Power Ranger movie that came out in 1995 was like literally my childhood, I would say this is the best Power Ranger movie of all times. This is pretty close, because it's hard to make a movie with a bunch of new people that you've never seen before for pretty much a whole new story. So obviously there had to be some character development that they didn't really need in the first movie. Because in the first movie, they had everybody that they was from uh, the TV show. They could hop right into the action. This one needed to take time and develop the characters, which I fully understand. And then the last 30, 40, maybe 50 minutes of the movie was actually them getting into the meat and grit and of it. Those of you who are interested in seeing the movie, make sure you stay till the end of the first credits. At least there is something at the end of those. I don't know if there was something at the end of the, the long list of credits because I didn't want to stay for that. But there was something at the end that you needed to see, which gave hint to the fact that there could be another movie. Everyone was saying that they're going to do some like cheesiness. They like give reference to the old show and stuff like that and make it feel like it doesn't really belong but they was like oh hey they did that a lot in the tv show the sad thing was alpha 5 aye, 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 aye. wasn't even that cheesy or at least wasn't the cheesiest thing they added in his actually made sense versus that one point when they walk on the pedestal and go it's morphin time i legitimately was just like Ugh, I, I can't hate it because I love the saying, but at the same time, did you have to make it so, so weird? Now, obviously, there was other, like, references to the TV show in there, like I said, Mariner Bay and Reefside, but there was other ones in there that, oh my god, there was at one point a classic song that if you ha are a fan of the show, you'll hear it and you'll just go, oh my god! <laughs> so it goes without saying, I enjoyed the movie. Thoroughly. The movie was amazing. My one thing that I hated about the movie, actually two things, was Goldar and the Megazord. Because the way that the Megazord came together was in the way I was afraid it was going to do. You don't really get to see the whole... Hey, this is amazing! I seem to know how to drive this thing! Permanent. I do too. It's almost like second nature to me. Like you did when you were a kid watching the TV show, or even the movie, the last movie. Actually, the, the two movies prior to this, Turbo and the Mighty Morphin Power Rangers movie, they both had it so that you could see the combination happening. In this one, you don't get to see that, which I was like, and you just look so weird. I really, really, really hope that they do some more movies, because... I enjoyed this, and if they do more movies, they need to protect these actors, make sure they're happy, because I, the last thing I need is to hear that uh, somebody 
or one of the people that played in the movie are no longer going to be in there and they just feel the need not to make the movies anymore. You know, like, they felt as if, uh, eh, it's too awkward playing as these characters. I don't want to do this anymore. You get in that spandex suit and you're going to like it because we want you to. But that's just me. Let me know in the comments below what you felt about the movie. And once again, it is my birthday, so wish me a happy birthday. It'd mean a, the world to me if I got a lot of people saying that because I'm like, oh my god! They really do care. I'm not 100% certain what I'm going to do today because I do have work. If I didn't have work, I'd be like, well, obviously I'm going to do a bunch of recordings. Um, I'm going to go see Power Rangers again because that movie was lit. Dog, it was lit. And I'm thinking of getting the Elgato because I did get a nice big paycheck this week. Let me know what games you'd like to see me play because I have Bioshock, which... I could not stream. I wanted to stream that game, but they wouldn't let me stream it because the whole entire thing was blocked. Because it was a blocked scene, which makes no sense if a whole entire game is blocked. It's like giving the middle finger to anyone who streams uh, using something other than an Elgato or some sort of connection system. But let me know what you guys think in the comments below. Hopefully I have another year of greatness to give to you guys and for me to grow into so thank you once again so hopefully you guys enjoyed this video and hopefully i will see you guys next time but until then deuces